Hello, welcome back to the Spiders Web, and in this video, we're going to be finishing off the computer monitors. This is what we've got so far with these two. However, we're not leaving them like that. They're actually fully painted now. What I've also done on here as well is gone over the um, these little bendy pipes with some of the um, Jacaro Orange that are used for this here. So as I said, these are how they're looking. These two are looking now. The others are looking slightly different. I will bring them on and you can see. There we are. That's one of them. That's another. Then we have these two. Now what I've done is I've taken some little, um, whatchamacallit, taken some of these that I've just printed so printed off some um, computer sci-fi computer monitor screen things and basically I've printed them off on uh, glossy paper. Now you can get uh, water slide transfer paper for printers um, but I haven't got any I did have but I can't find them so I've got those and bear with me a second um, I've got a few others a couple of others as well here there we are and I've got those three as well so what are we going to, which ones are we going to use? I think what we might do for the horizontal one, I like the look of this one. And what I've basically done is I've measured the area where it's going to be going into and slightly gone over. And then what I want to do now is cut it to size. Okay. So I want to cut it to the size I want it. I'm not going to be going incredibly um, accurate with this. It's just a case of making sure the majority of it fits. Now there is an angle in the corners. I'm just going to I'll say guess it basically. Um, just one, two, three. Snip off the corners. Let's see if that fits. Yep, that fits. So what I'm doing now is I'm getting some the Gorilla Glue clear. I suppose you can use PVA but I'm using this stuff because it's handy. And I'm going to pop some on here and then this little tool I'm just going to spread it out over the um, surface of where it's going to be. Yeah. Wipe it off, and then if I can grab hold of it, yeah, <laughs> get the image. I'll slot it onto the like so, and that is it for that one. This one. I think what's the, which one I do for that one? I did that one for that. Um tell you what, let's do this one as though it's on standby. Um pop it over to one side and then oops and then I'll just snip 
snip. 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 Take our image. Does it fit in adequately enough? No, it's a bit big at the moment. So we will snip a little more off. The the and the how about now? Um that's not look too bad. Then let's just snip the corners off the same as we did last time. So it's a snip. Snip, snip, snip. How's that work? Is that okay? That fits in okay. So I'm not looking for perfection with this as long as it fits in, it makes it look a little more interesting. We'll get the glue where we want it. Spread it round. I don't want to use brushes or anything for this because it's going to ruin the brushes. If you've got any old knackered brushes, you can use them, but I don't particularly want to use them and have to throw them away afterwards when I can just use this metal tool and give it a wipe off. And once that's done, we can pop that in the like so and there we have our finished monitors so there we are there's those two those two and I so said because these are weird slightly like weird ones I've had to I use the same near enough pictures for them um, I've changed some around um, but that's what we get so all we have to do now is wait for these to dry and then I'll put um, a gloss varnish over these to make it look nice and shiny and there we have it so that is our uh, monitors I think though what I will do um, because they were looking a little flat at the moment. Um, I'll get some, once I can find it. Is it out already? No, it's not. At least not that I can see anyway. Um, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, you want it? You want it? So you are hiding in plain sight. So what I'm going to do is I'll get some Agrax Earthshade. Obviously give it a shake. We'll put those two to one side. And those two to one side. And we'll go into the Agrax Earthshade and go over... these pipes so hopefully uh, it'll make them stand out a little more that's better you can actually see the um, what's the word I'm looking for a little not crenellations what's the word I'm looking for little dips in the pipe so we'll go 
and do both of these just like that and there we are we will finish the computer monitors there we are all that I have to do now is let it dry and that's it so where's my paper towel to dry my brush so next time um, well, the next thing we have to do with the um, Star Saga minis is the tables cabinets and that kind of thing but we'll do start that in the next video that's it for this one however um, as I said once these have dried fully um, I'll give them a spray with a, a gloss varnish I think a gloss varnish would work rather well on these with them being metal the same with the doors as well I'm going to give them a doors of gloss varnish so I'll move them out of the way I'll take these in fact no I won't because I want to get a red surf shade over with my fingers I'll just bring these in I'm hoping you can see I know you definitely can't see these two because the vertical but that's it as I said the computer monitors are done uh, as I say next on the agenda uh, the tables cabinets and whatnot so uh, join us in the next video when we'll be starting those until then as always take care god bless and bye for now